Hello, Berkshire Hathaway Home Services sales executives for our video message of the week. All right, we will continue our ongoing theme about personal and professional growth. Today's video message is entitled, Focus on Your Wins. Now, to do this, we're gonna start off with a few rules on winning that I really want you to keep in mind, all right, and internalize. First of all, you create what you think about. I know you've heard this before, but it is 1000% true. You create what you think about. So if we're gonna think about something, we certainly wanna think about winning as often as we possibly can. Second rule about winning, and that is the way you see the world, the way you see the world will either tell you that you're someone who focuses on wins or you focus on roadblocks. We don't wanna focus on roadblocks. Yes, they're out there, they happen to all of us. But the way you see the world is so important. So we wanna see the world based on wins, okay? You wanna see the world based on wins. And then the third rule of winning to lay the groundwork for today is remember, each and every day we all start back at zero. So no matter what happened the previous day, we all start perfectly the same, back at zero to say, you know what? I can have a winning day today regardless of what happened yesterday. All right, now, one area that I see that I think will be very, very uh, helpful for you is the way people uh, every day think about wins. See, wins can be many things, not only production. See, sometimes when we think about wins, we go right down to, well, I took a listing, I made a sale, I had a listing sold, that's a beautiful thing. I had a closing, those are all wins. Absolutely they're wins. But they're not the only wins out there. And if we're gonna focus every day in our mindset all the time on wins, we wanna be able to pull wins from other places besides the end result. So let's think about other wins that we can do. How about personal, okay, personal, maybe family wins. You know, for me, if the homework and the projects are done on time by my kids, that's a win. That is a big win and that can really get my day going in a positive road. You wanna go in search of these other wins, okay? What about achieving your daily commitments? No, no result happened that day, but you set out to speak to a certain amount of individuals and you accomplished it. I get goosebumps thinking about it. That's a win. Okay, you wanna focus on that. Not only the end result, but the process, okay? Getting to that end result, that activity. So in that example, you achieved your commitment and that is absolutely a win. Good habits in themselves are a win. It's a beautiful thing when you create a good habit, be it around business, be it around your life, physical, family, whatever it is, when you create that good habit and continue it going, that is absolutely a win. A win. And one last idea, and that is an improvement on a skill set. Do you ever think about this? Let's say you have had challenges in the past on something, but you went out, took the initiative, and increased and improved your skill set around a certain area. Let's say, you know what, you had an area around listing presentations, and you went out and said, you know what, I'm really gonna tie this down. And you took the time and you improved your skill set. Amazing, what a win. All right, if we're going to make sure that we always focus on our wins, then we wanna pull wins from every opportunity that we can. Remember, focusing on wins versus losses, roadblocks, or negatives, key. We want to focus on wins. Those others are there, they will always be there, that's great, but not here. What we focus on is always picking out what was the positive and what was the win to that. In, concluding, in conclusion today, why do we wanna always focus on wins? You know, the whirlwind gets us, life is happening, we're all moving quickly. Why do we always consistently wanna focus on wins? One, wins build momentum, okay? The more you focus on wins, okay, the more momentum, the excitement, you'll be positive, I promise you. And we're all connected. So when you're positive, you may not realize that it's bleeding out and affecting others, and bringing positive things to you, but I promise you, a leap of faith, it is. 
okay? Wins protect your attitude. So the more you think about wins, the less anything else can affect you because you continually think about what you accomplished, all the good, all the positive. You continually focus on those wins and that helps keep your attitude positive and productive at all times. And last, but certainly not le least, wins create more wins. The more wins you have, the more wins you have. It's a beautiful system, all right? Focus on your wins. I promise you, they're out there and they'll help you. Have a great week, everybody. We'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.